The programs are first, I believe, and I think it's brilliant. It really is giving an opportunity for one of our girls to go to another school that's totally different and experience a life that's nothing like what she would experience here at Summer Heights. It's a swap program. And I guess they're hoping to prove that you can get an equally valid and valuable educational experience in either the public or the private system. And we're looking forward to meeting our exchange student, aren't we? Perhaps you can tell, would you like to? We've got a, the school sent us over a tape so we can uh, be able to see uh, the student in it. Thanks, Chantelle. At Hilford Girls Grammar, we pride ourselves on cultivating girls who can succeed in not just one, but many areas. At Hilford, girls like me are offered a world of opportunity. Sport. <laughs> Drama. Music. More and more one, music. One, two. And of course, academia. It's a well-rounded education in an amazing environment. Hi, Miss. Hi, Jamie. What's all this? Looks like too much fun. Haven't you got an assignment due tomorrow? Oh, yeah. Thanks, Miss. Library, here I come. <laughs> yes, well, she's... To be honest, I can't wait to meet her. Oh, my God. Hi. I'm Jemay. It's so Hello. cool to be here. Hello. I'm Mrs. Hi. King. Nice it's a to lot meet to you. meet you. This is Chantel. Hi, Chantel. Hi. Got my bag. It's in the back. Um, oh my god, so you're going to Hilford? Yep. That's really cool. Mm -hmm. You'll fit in. There's so many Asians there. Oh. oh my god, it's so cool to be here. Get back in the car, you're not coming in the middle. Oh my god. Oh my it's so kind of like not shady. Do you know what I mean? Like there's not that many trees. No. Like no, I think when they were choosing people, like they wanted someone who was good at pretty much everything. And like, because it's going to be on the news and on TV and stuff, like I don't want to brag, but I think they wanted someone decent looking. It's way less, like, not crap, but less povo than I thought it would be. <gasps> That's cute. I love that. Yes, oh my God. What does that mean? I love your bins. They're so random. And teachers at my school are always going, Jemay, oh my God, you're the most likely to succeed and stuff, because I'm like the smartest non-Asian in year 11. This is my blazer colours. <laughs> and I'm good at spot and everything that Asians can't do, so I'm such a good ambassador for, for the school. The buildings are so kind of grey. Yes, they like, are. Like, no offence. I think I'm really going to love it here. Like, I've got a really good feeling about it. Public schools are so random. And I make friends really easily. Hi. I'm starting on Monday. Jamey. I can't wait to start. So I'm saying hi. Thank you, Mr Cameron, for your welcome. And thank you to the traditional landowners of Summer Heights, the Wurundjeri people. My name is Jamey. J-A apostrophe M-I-E. Weird name, I know, but you'll get used to it. Yes, I come from one of the most expensive private girls' schools in the state, but I'm actually really cool. Please don't be intimidated by me. People always go, private schools create better citizens, but I would say they create better quality citizens. Studies have shown that students from private schools are more likely to get into uni and end up making a lot more money, while wife beaters and rapists are nearly all public school educated. Sorry, no offence, but it's true. These are some photos of the world that I come from. My friends think I'm an idiot. They're like, why would you go to Summer Heights High? It's like the boganest school in the world. It's such a random thing for me to do, but I'm always doing things that like push outside the boundaries, do you know what I mean? That's me being an idiot. My friends say that I look like Misha Barton in that photo. I so don't. I usually try to avoid public school people, do you know what I mean? Like, one time I went to this year 10 formal with this guy from a public school as a joke. Like, me and my friends thought it'd be so cool to just check out all the bogans and stuff, do you know what I mean? And it was such a crap formal. Oh my god, that's some of my modelling portfolio shots. They should not be in there, that's really embarrassing. I think it's a, it's a dumb thing. Like, I think a lot of public school people are dumb. And I think that it's not really their fault. That's the thing. It comes from their parents. I'm up to a thousand friends on MySpace and I could always do with more. The kids have got a lot to learn at this school. I see everyone on Monday. Please come up and talk to me. Um, I won't bite. And I feel as though I can teach them how to behave in the real world, do you know what I mean?